Afternoon guys, um, today we have a little bit of everything. Um, we have a total body, we have cardio, um, and we've got a little finisher at the end. Uh, it's going to be quite a sweaty one. Uh, you don't even need some dumbbells uh, or a couple of bottles of water, but nothing major. Um, so I think, right, let's get going. So first thing I'm going to do, we're going to get into up dog, down dog. So down dog is where you have wrist and wrist underneath your shoulders. We push back through our heels and we rotate our hips towards the ceiling. And we get a nice hamstring stretch, calf stretch through there. Hold it for five seconds, then we come down into an up dog and we push our hips through the floor looking up towards the ceiling. That's the first thing. Okay, let's start. Three, two, one. Let's go. Down dog. Pushing through the heels. Head through the hands. Heels down. Three, two, one. Good. Hips to the ground. Push through, look up towards the ceiling. Three, two, one. Brilliant. Keep going, keep alternating. Just trying to rotate those hips as much as you can. Trying to straighten that back. Trying to get the head through the hands. Four, three, two, one. Keep going, you've got 20 seconds left, guys. So keep going on that one. In 15 seconds, we're going to do our thread through, thread the needle, which is the one where we're on all fours and we go through our shoulder to the ground. We open up, rotate our torso. Two, one, let's go. So on our knees, rotate through, get the shoulder to the ground. We open up, we look at our hand, and we just keep going through like that. So we're going to do 30 seconds one way, 30 seconds the other. Good, we've got five seconds. Then we switch. Two, one, cool, shoulder to the ground. Fifteen seconds. So keep going. In ten seconds, we're going to get stand up. We're going to go into a back lunge and then a knee raise. Three, two, one, let's go. So back lunge, knee raise, hold. That's it, shoulder stability. Good, drop down, knee up, keep going. So we do half the time one way, half the time the other, just warming up the legs, warming up the glutes for the stability. Five, three, two, one, and switch, drop. Lift. Brilliant. Not trying to rush through it. Take your time. Good. So keep going. In 15 seconds, we're going to do a thing called Cossack Squat. So our legs are wide, and we're just going to go to the side. We come back up. We go to the other side. We come back up. Okay. Three, two, one. Let's go. Side, up, side, up. And you might find a little bit of a groin stretch. It's just loosening up those hips as well. You should feel the heart rate starting to rise. Good. Each repetition is trying to sit down lower onto that hip. Good, but halfway through, So in 15 seconds, we are going to get the heart rate up a bit more. We're going to start jogging for 20 seconds, then we're going to do high knees for 20 seconds, and then we're going to sprint for 20 seconds. So two, one, okay, let's go. Jogging, 20 seconds. So in 10 seconds, we're just going to lift our knees to get them higher than our hips. 
three, two, one. Okay. Bouncing off the balls of your feet. Get your knees up. And then in 10 seconds time, we're going to get fast. One. 
30 seconds left, guys.
You've got 10 seconds to go. Five, three, two, one, and rest. Well done. Okay, we go with the hard one, which is both. We go in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. So, keep the low back on the ground. Where would you get that? Horrible sound. 15 seconds. If your low back's on the ground, your tummy is working. If your back is arching, your back is working. We don't want that to happen on this exercise. Keep it all in the tummy. And rest, well done. 10 seconds, and we're going for a 30 second hold. Four, three, two, one, go. You've got 10 seconds to go. Keep your feet together. Head and shoulders are up. Five. Three, two, one. Hey, well done. Well done, brilliant effort. Okay, right. We're going to get back into that total body stuff that we did at the start, the walkouts, um, thrusters, and then the single leg deadlift in rows. Now, as I said earlier, remember what you were able to achieve last time because that's your target now. So if I was on the third round, I'm ready to do the thrusters, two of them. So that's what I'm going to try and beat this time. Okay, four minutes again, guys. So, three, two, one, let's go. So, walk out, press up down, jump in, walk back, one. Stand back up. Pretty much every muscle working here. Almost every muscle. Two. Three. Four, one more. Great. Now the two exercises with the dumbbells. Thrusters. Let's 
gonna be close. Got 40 seconds left. Good, we've got 25 seconds. I'm going to do it, hopefully you guys are too. One, two, that's me made it. I've still got 15 seconds though. Ten seconds. We are alternating these ones. Steve! Well done guys. Well done legends. Okay. We are going to go back to some core work. So, we worked upper abs, lower abs last time. Now we're going to work obliques, but glutes. So we're working all the way around our, our core. So, first exercise, we're going to get into a side dip. So we're going to go faster and slowly down. Faster, slowly down. 30 seconds one way, 30 seconds the other. Then, we're going to lie on our back, we're going to have one leg up and we're going to drive through our hips and slowly lower your hips down. Fast, slowly down. Make sure you're pushing through the heel of the standing leg and that will make your glutes fire up. Same idea, 30 seconds long, 10 seconds off. Three, two, one. Let's go. Lightly touch, fire. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. Okay, ten second transition time. Make sure you get to the other side. So the hard option is feet on feet, easy option is bent knees, and we do it like this. Up to you. Okay, we're off. Slowly lower, drive it back up. Halfway. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Recover, well done, 10 seconds into our leg lifts, or hips, sorry, bridges. Three, two, one, drive. Slowly lower. Push through that heel. Fifteen seconds to go. So you want to feel your glute on the standing leg, your bottom. Make sure it's tense. Three, two, one, well done. Switching legs in 10 seconds. Four, three, two, one, and go. Drive, slowly lower, drive, lower. Halfway through. Push, make sure your knees, your hips, your shoulders are in a straight line on the highest point. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Well done, well done. Okay, right, we go with one more round of that. <clears throat> okay, we're gonna go in 10 seconds, guys. Bent knees or straight legs, up to you. Five, four, three, Two, one, up, lower, fast. You should really feel this underside of bleaks working. Your shoulders will be working as well, just lifting the body weight up, but the obliques are going to keep everything in the middle up as well. You should feel this tense. Three, two, one, well done, switch sides. 
So now you look on the other end of the side of the leak. Four, three, two, one, go. You've got 10 seconds to go. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Well done, 10 seconds. Then we do the bridges. Four, three, two, one, go. Fast up, control down. Halfway through. You got five seconds. Three, two, one. Well done. Ten seconds off. Go to the other side. Five, four, three, two, one. Go. Last thirty. Then we've got a bit of high heart rate to finish, guys. Halfway on the time. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Hey, well done. Well done. Okay, we've done the core. We've done upper body. We've done lower body. We've got the heart rate up a bit. Mobility at the start. But let's finish on a high heart rate. So, first thing that we're going to do. We're going to do quick feet, and every time I say go, we're going to jump and we're going to back to the feet, okay? That's going to be the first 30 seconds. Second 30 seconds, we're going to do quick feet. When I say go, we're going to jump and turn, and then we alternate. Third 30 seconds, quick feet, and we do a burpee, and the last 30 seconds, we're just going for quick feet, okay? Ready, two minute burnout. Three, two, one, go, quickly.